With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, let's discuss the question. The question says that a compound has the following percentage composition. C that is carbon as 40%, H that is hydrogen as 6.7%, O means oxygen as 53.3% and the vapor density of the compound is given as 30. We have to calculate its molecular formula and the given molecular formula for carbon, hydrogen and oxygen are given. So let's list down what is given to us. So first we will write given things. The given things give are percentage of carbon, percentage of carbon which is given as 40%, percentage of hydrogen is given to as 6.7% and that to percentage of oxygen is given to as 53.3%. Moreover, if you look onto the question, it is also given that vapor density and we will denote it as VD is given as 30. What we have to find, we have to find molecular formula. So let's begin the question. First we will try to find the molecular mass of the compound. So for this we will need help of vapor density. We will write the formula of vapor density and formula of vapor density that is VD is given by capital M by 2. What is capital M? Capital M is molecular mass or we also say molar mass pull upon 2. So if you look on to the capital M then it will come down to be 30 into 2 that is 60. So we are come up with our molecular mass that is 60. We will keep it as it will help in further problem. So now let's write an statement. Let us assume Cx, Hy, Oz to be molecular formula of compound. By this we have assumed the molecular formula of a compound and it is given in the problem that the carbon is present in 40%. So first write the percentage of carbon. So percentage of carbon we have formula as mass of carbon whole upon molar mass or molecular mass into 100 and uh, we know the percentage of carbon it is given as 40 percent. So 40 is equal to mass of carbon is 12 into x. How 12 into x? 12 is mass of one carbon and x is the number of carbon. So if you look onto the total mass of the carbon then it will become 12x. Whole upon molar mass that we have calculated comes out to be 60 into 100. If we do the calculation of this we will find out that x comes out to be 2. So we are come up with our x. Now we will try to find y and z in a similar manner. So first we will write mass of hydrogen which is given as 1 that is mass of 1 hydrogen into the number of hydrogen atoms in this case we have taken as y so in total y and the percentage formula of hydrogen is given by mass of hydrogen 
अपॉन मोलर मास ऑफ कंपाउंड इन टू हंड्रेड एज इट इज परसेंटेज सो इफ यू लुक दैट द हाइड्रोजन परसेंटेज इज गिवेन एज सिक्स पॉइंट सेवन एंड वाई होल अपॉन सिक्सटी इन टू हंड्रेड दिस जीरो दिस जीरो गॉट कैंसल डिवाइडिंग बाय टू वी विल गॉट हेयर थ्री एंड हेयर फाइव एंड वाई कम्स आउट टू बी सिक्स पॉइंट सेवन इन टू थ्री होल अपॉन फाइव Approximately four. We will look into the integer value of y because compounds here are in integral form. That is, x, y, and z are integers. So, approximate value of y comes out to be four. So, y comes out to be four. Let's mark it down also. Now it's time to find z. That is, number of atoms of oxygen. So, first we will write mass of oxygen. Which comes out to be sixteen. That is mass of one oxygen into number of oxygen. That is Z, which comes out to be sixteen Z. And if we look onto the formula, percentage of oxygen equals to mass of oxygen whole upon molar mass. Into hundred. So if we keep the value, the percentage of oxygen is given to as fifty three point three equals to sixteen Z whole upon sixty into hundred. Again zero zero got cancel five three. And if we do more calculations, then Z comes out to be fifty three point three. Into three whole upon sixteen into five, which approximately comes out to be. So we have finally got Z also. So Z comes out to be two. Now if we look to the molecular formula, that we have assumed C X. H Y O Z is now turned as C two H four O two, and this is the required answer for it. By this, we have completed the question, and I hope I was able to help you in the question. Thank you. For class six to twelve, ITJ and NEET level, trusted by more than five crore students. Download Doubt and App today.